Welcome to Cointable. I'm Chris Tisdale. In this video, we're going to talk about these seven coins that I just got back from PCGS. We're going to go ahead and look at what I thought it would grade, and then we're going to reveal what it actually graded. All right, guys, the first coin is a 1909 SVDB. Tell me what you guys think it'll grade. I believe this coin is going to grade four, maybe six. G4, G6, somewhere in there. Oh, and it did grade good, six. Tell me in the comments what you guys thought it would grade on all these coins. Next, we have the 1937D three-legged buffalo. You notice that front leg is completely missing. I would grade this coin an eight. Tell me what you think in the comments. All right, let's see how PCGS graded it. All right, they graded it a VF20. So I believe I kind of overshot, or actually I believe I undergraded this one. So that's always a nice surprise. All right, here we have an 1894 Morgan dollar. Now this coin looks like it has the detail, uh, the luster, to be an XF coin. And so I could see them, ah, but it looks cleaned maybe, scratched. I, I could see them either, get, either giving it an XF details or maybe net grading this coin down to like a VF 30 or 35. So again, to be clear, I would say that this coin is either going to grade VF 30 or 35. If they give it a straight grade, if they call it a details coin, I think it'll be XF details. Tell me what you guys think. Here's the 1894 Morgan. It graded VF 30. So th this is the coin where I was kind of concerned as to whether or not they would just net grade it or, you know, how that would look. And, um, you know, I'd like to say they net graded at VF30, but who knows? Maybe they just thought it was a VF30. All right, next we're going to take a look at the 1889 CC Morgan. I think this coin's a pretty straightforward. If they straight graded, I, I think it'll grade 12. All right, that Morgan graded F12, 1889cc Morgan in F12. Now, to me, when I look at this coin, I just see a, a very honest circulated coin, just super honest wear, problem-free. It's just a really, really nice coin for what it is. So tell me in the comments how you would have graded that. Next, we've got the 1934S Peace dollar. You can see it's got a little bit of wear. Um, I also believe that this coin's either been cleaned or, yeah, probably just improperly cleaned. But then on the reverse, it, it's got what I think is going to boil down to environmental damage. So I think this coin's going to grade AU details. What do you think? Now that 1934S piece dollar graded AU detail, genuine, cleaned. 
Okay, now, I, you know, I, yeah, I, I just, I, I don't know. And it goes to show that even with a, what I would consider a highly developed eye, there are still things where I, I've got to learn more. Um, that, that's one thing about being in the coin business is you never stop learning. As soon as you stop learning, you're going to start making mistakes and, and uh, stop getting better. Moving on. Next, we've got the 1882CC Morgan. I think it's an MS64 solid four shot five. I think if it were any other mint mark, it would be a five, but lately I feel like they are just a little bit more strict on Morgans that are Carson City mint. So MS64 shot five on this one. hit pause on this video right now leave me a comment as to how you would grade the coin again hit pause tell me in the comments how you would grade this 1882 Morgan hopefully you did that here we go now that coin guys that coin graded MS 65 that is correct the 1882 CC Morgan came back MS 65 so I thought I had a shot and it did Excited about that. All right, next we have the 1928 Peace Dollar. Now I'm gonna go ahead and say that this is an AU58. All right, now let's take a look at how that one graded. Okay, this one came back genuine. It's an AU coin with damage. This coin, you guys, I don't know. I really don't know about this. Um, it's got honest wear, okay? I, I thought this coin was an AU58. Um, it, it's got some... Uh, well, at least based on myself looking at the coin, the only thing I could imagine they, they said was the damage are these bag marks over here. But you guys, they're just bag marks. Like, they threw all these coins in, in bags of a thousand of them and then, like, bounced them across the United States on a horse and carriage. So there's coins getting bagged up and getting bag marks. And, and that's what I'm seeing here. Um, tell me in the comments if you see something else or something more, something that I'm missing. I, I could be missing something, but I don't think I am. Um, I, I just, I really believe this coin's an AU58 coin. And, and even at that, it's a very, very nice AU. I mean, I can see it grading AU58 plus. It, it looks better than most 61s, 62s, and probably even most 63s you're going to find out there. So anyways, tell me what you think in the comments. All right, guys, there you have it. Thanks again for watching. Please like, subscribe, share it with your friends if you're into this type of content, and uh, I will see you guys next time.